most iconic rivalries in the history of sports. Like, there are multiple theories of how Pete Rozelle tried to fuck Al Davis. What it do, what it is, it's your boy Schefter, AK Drug Wizard, AK Mr. Go It All, AK, you favorite YouTubers, favorite YouTuber. So, like, basically, the the main person in the NFL, the Roger Goodell of 100 million years ago, literally hated Al Davis. Was he a coach? He was the owner of the Raiders. Oh, okay. There's a lot of speculation. Yo, what's up, girl? How you doing? So the commissioner hated the owner. Yeah, there's a lot of speculation about botched draft picks because the owner didn't, or because uh, the commissioner didn't get them through. Into I mean, there's just is it nap time yet, girl? I'm just sharing the stream. Give me a second, guys. Yeah, uh, I totally forgot. I didn't even know this 3030 was popping until about an hour ago. Because this was not on my agenda for today, but I figured, shit, I was going to watch it, so I might as well watch it with Keegan, Chill and Keegan with y'all. I'm amazed when some men say love. I only wanted to be loved by my players and the people I live with. Yeah, so needless to say, they did not have the best relationship. Like, he sued the NFL. He, he personally How sued. How long did this go on? Oh, the whole time Pete Rozelle was the owner, was the commissioner. How long was that? It was a long time. It was just constant, nonstop, back and forth. Al Davis was convinced that the NFL was out to get him. Right? In some cases, I think so. Yeah, it's too early for nap. No, it's not too early for nap time. It's never too early for nap time, girl. I hung around the football practices so much, taking notes, studying the coaches, how it was done. They thought I was a spy. In a way, I was. I was on the outside of that world looking at How are your right. crab legs? You got a mess going on, so are you done? Yeah, I'm done. How are your crab legs? Thank you. Keep going. Keep going with the rest of your trash over oh. there. Did all that cost you basically your DoorDash money? No, no. Oh, really? Uh -uh. I figured it was like 25, 25 bucks ish. It was after tip. It was like, I was twenty five. Oh, okay. In the Navy, I sold a bunch of the fellas on a penny. I guess that's ironic considering I later suspended players for gambling. We had a lot of Irish guys. Yeah, their hate is pretty deep rooted. It's extremely deep rooted. So, is this trash? You just left on the counter? Yeah. Is there a reason why you left on the counter? Is there a reason you do have to shit you do? Well, considering that it's right next to the trash can. No, you know what? Save it. I'm I'm saving it. I'm gonna put it in a picture frame. Oh well, I guess I can't put it in a picture frame now. Um, Ain't nobody got time for that. I got bronchitis. They need to get to the mean bones of this story. The National Football League wasn't a billion dollar business like it is today. You just didn't have the money. A few years later, finally broke into pro football. For good. It wasn't with the NFL. Oh, guys, I apologize. Handle the business. Handle the business. Will you get that, please? 
Yo, what's up, Greg? Trying to help you back. All right. What do you What do you need? A match? I don't know. Somebody doesn't have cigarettes. Somebody needs cigarettes. I don't know. Oh, so you just came over to give me a heads up. I am going to walk her. All right. So please tell him not to walk me out. All right. Yo, what's up, bro? Make America trap again. After this, we're gonna end the stream. I'm gonna change, and then I'm gonna do the Lakers Nuggets game. But I had to do fucking Pete Rosell versus the Raiders. You know what I mean? Like I had to. I thought it was Christian first. I scrambled back up, thanks. Don't talk to cat like that. Uh, it's where ESPN just tell a story about tell stories about things that happened in sports. You really don't know who Al Davis is? Levi, get the fuck out of here. How do you not know who the fuck Al Davis is? Ain't no, I got bronchitis. Ain't nobody got time for that. Pete Rosell and Al Davis had a, for those who don't know, very, very, very brutal feud. Yeah, the he was the owner of the Raiders. Yeah, you know, the NFL football team. Yeah. All right, let me grab my phone. Miller trying to pull off a deal for a trade for a fucking Herbert card. Don't lock the door. Lacey's walking the dog. Uh, I had washed my hands. I'm going outside. He's trying to smoke back. All right. <laughs> get your smoke on. I had no cigarette. You don't have any of my black person. You don't have a cigarette. Gotta get your puff on. The way was coming. Yo, they slow dragging this, man. How long is this? Like an hour? If it's only an hour. They really slow dragging this. All right. Well, it's an hour and a half. So. Damn, that was a strong Yeah, bro. That wind be hitting you different. I think that you're the big one. I can't tell you how great to laugh. The game kept getting big. We came up with an AF. I can't think of a bigger owner commissioner feud ever in the history of sports, really. Like, I seriously cannot. Uh, I'm working on it, man. I'm in the middle of working on it. I'm trying to pull off a trade. Al Davis is a dark fighter. Al Davis will do anything to beat you. He'll muscle you. He'll crowd you. He'll fight like Roberto Duran in his prime. I hired the youngest head coach in the league. John Madden, the into the John Madden, John Madden will probably never get the respect he properly deserves as one of the most brilliant minds in football. Had it not been for his fear of flying. Whoa, let's come down over there, killer. 
This nigga didn't want to coach us. Take what they give. They tell you that. Fuck the coach. You said fuck the coach. You said fuck the Raiders. Well, that all sounds good to everybody, but I always went the other way. We're going to take what we want. I wanted the power, a quick strike. Hey, did they take his back? Do what? Did they take his back? No, he getting fat. It's all that dog food he be eating. And they've got the speed to do it, and they will do it. It's like having a bomb and being the one to drop it. Shit, fuck this turning. Psychologically, it's a temptation. Uh, yeah, we're down to select, ovation, contenders, and SPX for right now. Uh, we got some stuff coming in this weekend, but... <laughs> Yo, Jollywood. Oh, crazy in the building. What's up, crazy? Oh, shit. I even, I haven't even calculated those numbers. More than you can afford, Levi. More than you can afford. Um, he has six. He has some RPAs, uh, and some base sign Herbert cards. So I just sent him a bunch of shit I got for trade. It's always hit or miss for me. Either something that's too expensive or something that's the wrong size. You might want to put some of your new beers in the fridge so they can get cold. He doesn't care about the Oh, please. Hold on. What's that? No, I'm not calling them cheap. I'm just saying it's a lot of money to buy out to buy out everything. It's a lot of money. That would be even with a discount. That would be. <laughs> I have no idea. It would be a lot. It would be like a lot. Um, five. Seven. Ernie, what was the last time they ate? Eleven. The last time I fed him. Twelve. Fifteen. Eighteen packs in total. Eighteen packs in total. Ernie. Huh. When was the last time they ate? The last time I fed them, I don't know. I, I don't know if I was. So should they feed them or no? Now they can serve. All right, you can feed them. Oh, you see it? Yeah, you see it. Nah, he's not here yet. He's not here yet. He's safe so far. Okay. Hey, Susie, pop me up. Say, well, we here. I'm back I'm fine. I'm not hitting me. What's going on, people? Black African Americans? I think I feel like, yeah, I got to fish that. I told you it was that damn win. I think I hear they're holding shit. Yeah, I got Yo, I'm kind of disappointed. They're not getting into the meat and bones of this shit yet. They're keeping it very basic. All right, bro, I'll shoot you a price, but. Everything. Mm -hmm. 
I see the rock, rock lines. <laughs> Again, you got you got nobody right here. John Madden, Ed McGall, and myself, the Oakland Raiders, the magnificent on that football field today. Super, super champions. Well, do me a favor, make sure you hit the like button. We're proud to represent you, and we intend to hold it. What about you? We were talking about that. You want to no. say something else? Like yeah. People dying, they beat. About the 76 game, everyone should know those two safeties, Atkinson and Kaden. <laughs> <laughs> they, uh, they were in the hearts of everyone who's ever. Oh, man. I just I feel like John Madden doesn't get the respect he deserves. Like, I believe he was a hired, hired as a head coach at what? Crazy, 32, 33 years old? Uh, probably the youngest head coach hired at that time in the history of football. So why you think they, they go every, uh, every Madden? Don't uh, you say they can name Madden, 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 Madden? Yeah, well, right. But, I mean, he's bigger than a video game, bro. He was actually a head coach. A really good one. Yeah, I thought it was 32 or 33, but I can't say for sure. I don't remember specifically. Mm. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to figure out. How the whole beef started. How did the whole beef with Pete Rosell and Al Davis start? Our contention, it was criminal to live with malice and with no uh, relationship to the game of football at all. When you go out on that football field to play next time, you think you'll be scared or scared to some word you use? No, scared is a very good word. <laughs> because I have this particular Damn, he said scared is a good, you, good word. You, yo, the Raiders didn't play back then. What happened now? <laughs> they was, yo, they was coming for that ass. Yeah, crazy. That's basically uh, that's basically what it what it came down to. He wasn't kidding. You know, that's 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 the kind of stuff that we're talking about in Pittsburgh and no, but it's it look like it's just put it on our own. That was close, I had the right number. He definitely wasn't kidding. It was the first instance of a panic over litigation. Uh yo, after this I'm gonna turn the Lakers game on. Yeah, that's all Levi's. If you guys haven't yet, don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe. Levi just did some fucking Godfather type shit. He just bought us all the way out, like all the way out. Yeah. So everything you see about us right now is Levi's. Uh, we'll open them at his beck and call, obviously. You can't just come to spread down what you want to. All right, let me make a cocktail. I shall return. Sean Michaels fan or what? I fuck with Sean Michaels. And I want to have people on committees that can think of the overall interests of the league rather than themselves. Make sure you hit that like button. He better stick with Raw or NST. He better off with NST because he knows he can hold his brother. Well, Raiders right, gonna beat his ass. Yeah, um, yeah, once again, Levi did buy everything. Literally everything. 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 What's going on, Greg? What's going on, Pepper? 
living here, chilling, chilling, relaxing. No, he can't. I mean, we just always kind of always shot at us. Do I like Buffalo Ray Dudley? Of course. I don't, I don't fuck with the Dudley boys. I ain't no fuck with the Dudley boys. Why? Because he look like Buffalo Ray. Yo, I don't fuck with the Dudley boys. <laughs> My dumbass, when I was younger, I always thought, I always thought they were actual brothers. Oh, I thought they was actual brothers because yo, where I'm from, I didn't see a black mom and a white pops have like a totally white son and totally like I've seen it. Yeah, Levi came through and stashed it all up. Well, I hear, yo, a lot of people do a lot of talking, but Levi, Levi bought it out. So anytime you want to pack open the tiz, we moved our two jazz cards to PJ. You also have to save 65 live channels. Plus, Sounds good to me, Levi. Don't throw at me with a good time. Uh, we'll be here for this. And then after this, we're going to jump over to the Lakers game. Melbourne, Australia. Well, they say we all packs, so yes. Every pack, every goddamn pack. Every goddamn pack. Y'all don't have to because y'all ain't fall asleep, nigga. <laughs> you said we open the all packs. Nigga. Well, no, I'm going to make sure he's in oh, here. No. No, I'm not going to open the packs when I'm in here. That'd be some fuck shit. You know what I'm saying? Oh, bro. You just watched Four Brothers? Oh, I saw that shit in theaters. I saw that in theaters too, but I ain't doing the nigga thing. Good old Cracker Jack. Mark Wahlberg, Mark Wahlberg was badass in that movie. Oh, yeah. So I think it's uh, Bobby. <laughs> hey, you live in La Vida Loca. <laughs> Stop being me. Stop being me. All right, here we go. Now we're starting to get in a little bit of the rivalry between Pete Rosell and Al Davis. This is this is what uh Levi, let's call it ten. Let's call it ten. <laughs> he jumped. He just jumped recklessly. There's a state senator who dared the Vikings to move. He seemed to think the NFL would never let it happen. They call his bluff. I don't think so. What's it get to be fair? We got eight motherfuckers. We should have eight likes. And then we got four out of eight. Yeah, if you guys have yet, don't forget to drop a like, tell a friend, tell a grandma, tell a baby mom. What the fuck is that shit? That's some prehistoric shit. That's like a backwards cannon. That's what I thought it was for a moment. <laughs> That's old school shit. Like a slavery time. Yeah. 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 Y
Around the hee haw, get her done, boys. That's an ugly motherfucker, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, Cam, he did. He got everything out. So hopefully my new shit gets here on Saturday. So they didn't tell me tomorrow. be at the door. I'm gonna be asleep, I'll be at the door. That's why he always work at the work. I know I just gonna try to get something. <laughs> yeah, you gonna get some bullet in that ass is what you're gonna get. Might take a picture on Facebook like wanted to be a general of one team, one team only. They were part of a bigger league. Now we're getting the meat potatoes of this shit. On January 7th, he told me... Yeah, we get to the great end. Oh, Levi, we finally got Mosaic coming in. 2019 Mosaic NBA. I finally got my hands on a mega box. And then he said to me, no. I am seriously thinking about moving to Los Angeles. And I said, well, if you are, if you decide you want to pursue it further, let yeah, me know. Yeah, the, them's not going to be cheap because you know you get a Zion, a Jaw, RJ, Bear, yo, the rookies in that class. Woo -hoo -hoo. Everyone's looking for that 2019 mosaic. It's pricey as fuck, man. He said he brought him on two hands. He said he said. Yeah, I'm not even yo. That that shit was hard as fuck for me to find it at a somewhat decent price. Yeah, we gonna see. I always kind of felt like, and I'm not a Raiders fan, but I always kind of feel like feel like Pete Rozelle did the Raiders wrong. Like Al Davis was more right than wrong. Now he wasn't always right. Well, you know we'll be here, man. What's you know up, we'll be man? here. Yo, what's up, Sebastian? That's a weird Sebastian. Huh? That's a weird Sebastian. No, it's just a movie. Yeah, yeah, no, nah, it's just regular Sebastian. All right, Levi, I got you during the next commercial. I mean, I don't know about those. Yeah, the Raiders have always notoriously, to this day, even in Vegas, the Raiders are the poorest team in football. They're they're because uh, the Lakers uh, are are pretty poor too because the Raiders and the Lakers owners only that's their only key business like Stan Kroenke the owner of the Rams uh, he has a gazillion businesses uh, the dude that just bought the Carolina Panthers is like one of the top five richest people in the world. Like the owner of the Lakers and Raiders are like millionaires, and most of these motherfuckers are billionaires. What a Billy, a Billy, a Billy, a Billy. If he had a choice, what tip would you buy? What sport? Knicks. Mm. Because the Knicks need new ownership, and I would be just the guy for them. Uh, you, you gotta talk to Jay Z. <laughs> Jay Z don't own shit. Nah, he had he had uh he had stock, and then that's but he had to sell it when he became an agent. Hey. Yo, what's up, Fabs? Yeah, yo, yo, the Raiders used to be really good. The Raiders used to be really good. John Madden was the truth. I mean, and they did it with bummy quarterbacks, too. Jim Plunkett, like, yikes, you know? <laughs> uh, I don't think anyone has a favorite Dim Franchise Boys song. I'm like, look, you went way back. <laughs> like, me with a rock with it. Like, I bang in my white teeth. Give it my white teeth. Roll in the club. 
Don't spit my own juice on my white teeth. <laughs> Nah, not yet, Fabs. I was going to mail today, but uh, nothing got mailed out today. <laughs> Whew, Levi, did you get or give any points, and where is it at? Because once this is over, I'm going live for that shit. No, I said, I said Nuggets. Lakers are going to win. 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 All right, Fabs, appreciate that, man. But I got you. Don't worry. Travis Porter. Or the goat in music. Don't get me wrong. I mean, he's not a goat, but he does you know that guy from music. Yeah, isn't that crazy? Like the Knicks fuck everything up, and they're still the most NBA, most valuable NBA franchise. Yeah, yo, bro, the Lakers are gonna win. You gotta accept that. Move on. Thank you, Levi. Somebody agrees with me. Once again, make sure y'all hit that like button if y'all agree with Isaac. If not, put the thumbs down if you agree with Ernie. <laughs> Everybody agrees with Isaac. <laughs> What's going on? What's going on? Okay. I'm sure people have been talking about the Eagles Raiders matchup, but they've been talking just as much about the matchup of one Al Davis against Pete Rosell. Yeah, but let's not act. Let's not act like real estate's uh, super cheap in L.A. either, though. Crazy. You know what I mean? Like, it's just as expensive in L.A. as it is in New York. It is a depressing when you have the play on the field and the excitement of the fans. I'm looking out for the pressure because that pressure came out perfect. I was in there flipping the wrist. And then cooking. Been looking up, looking at the rim. Been looking up, looking when I hit. Yo, you ain't bringing that shit back over. I did bring it over. Oh, did you? All right. Well. I just the guy that was nice to you. Oh, yeah, yeah. Well, she didn't tell me. Yeah, LA is high as fuck. Oh, Bean, the 30 for 30s are great, man. Oh, yeah. Hold on. Is he, in Pete Rozelle's phrase, a charming rogue who has become an outlaw? Well, Al isn't here to give us the answers. Yeah, so see, Pete Rozelle kind of started calling him out. I feel like as a commissioner, you can't really do that. I feel like this not Al Davis's fault. Yo, if you put someone as boisterous as Al Davis in a corner, they're going to come out swinging. Al was the general who gave the orders but never committed the acts of war himself. So I wasn't surprised when I heard that during the Raiders' midweek walk, the only damage incurred was to the football logo and to the midfield. I mean, yeah, I, I would assume so too, crazy, but I mean, don't the Lakers own their arena as well? I mean, and the Knicks haven't uh, the Knicks haven't updated anything in forever, and the Knicks always be doing dumb shit. She's not trying to hear it, bro. I think you say it was a hit. She said she. I said, that's what I said. She's not trying to hear it, bro. No, I didn't. I didn't. Uh, Levi, yeah, you killed it, man. Um, I don't know. PTI is pretty good. I feel like PTI is pretty well is pretty well constructed. Well, I've been to Madison Square Garden. I've never been to Staples Center, so I don't know. Um, and the NFL Stan Kroenke is the richest owner in the NFL. And in the NBA, I want to say what? It's Steve Ballmer? Or is it the Blazers owner? Crazy might be able to help me with that. There was talk the Raider players had plans for me during the trophy presentation. 
some kind of crash. Hold on. No, it's definitely not possible. Yeah, that had to be scary for Pete Rosell right there. Being aware of the plans, celebration plans, nor how they did or didn't plan to show their relative loyalties for the participants of the ceremony. No, I just I always found this rivalry very intriguing. Yeah, I thought it was Balmer. Thanks very much, Commissioner. Yeah, uh, yeah, Raider is definitely not a party. I thought it was Bomber, but I thought it could have been the uh, the Portland owner. Because now that what's his face passed away, I, I forget if his sister runs the team or whoever runs the team, but I thought it could be them. Yeah, you had to catch Tony you are magnificent out there. Uh, I can't see. Uh, I can't say I have been. Keep chick screaming. I heard that be here watching your guys' investments and shit. Yeah, well, uh, the, the Clippers own that the forum now. Uh, no, the Bears owner is not uh, the richest owner of football at all by any means. I'd stand cronky. <laughs> yeah, it's no, nah, it's definitely Stan Kroenke. <laughs> Yo, Al Davis just up and moved the team and said, fuck what anybody said. It's like, yo, it's my team. Fuck y'all. That's the shit I would do. Yeah, well, yeah, well, that's fine, Bean, but they're still not the, they're still not the wealthiest owner in football. That, that's, that's the discussion we were having. Is who's the wealthiest owner? And uh, it's, it's Stan Kroenke, and I think it's Stan Kroenke, and it's not even close. Guys, Isaac wasn't alive during Super Bowl 51. Don't forget that. Isaac wasn't even alive during Super Bowl 51. Yeah, so Super Bowl 51, Isaac wasn't even made yet. Uh, grab your bottle on top of the counter. Are you all right? She chill. I guess you don't want to shot then. No, Super Bowl 51. Levi, Super Bowl 51. Isaac wasn't even born, according to Isaac, at Super Bowl 51. Uh, watch out, I got fight with I got fight with animals and shit. Every time I come over here, I got fight with animals. Um, I Levi, I always I love the thirty for thirties. So you're saying Save the Last Dance was boring? I don't know if I can go that far. Yeah. No, the fucking thirty for thirty, the Michael Jordan series. Now, you don't got fucking cable. You don't know about this shit. Yeah, it was called Save the Last Dance. I think you talking about the movie. No, it was a ten part series by uh for Michael Jordan. Uh, he does. He does. He owns more. 
He owns more than just the LA Rams. They don't bring your black ass. You know, black scared ass on. If you get bit in the leg, I'll just be like, yo, Miss Carrie, he asked for it. Oh, fuck. See you straight. No. If I look at the eye. Yeah, Save the Last Dance was on point. In the movie. No, we're not talking about the movie. No one cares about the movie. Babs, what the fuck are you talking about? Whose teammates hated who? I just pop up. Yeah, I've seen that. They're supposed to be doing one on Kobe and one on LeBron and one on Carl from Aqua Teen Hunger Force. Oh, one that. from fucking Tiffany for like, yeah. I want to see that new special now coming out. I don't know why. Yeah, but the first one was dope. The second one gonna be pooped down. Yo, Michael Jordan's teammates loved him. Like, yeah, did he punch people in the face? Sometimes. Did he cuss people out? Sometimes. But sometimes that's what a leader has to do. <laughs> Ain't nobody got bronchitis. Ain't nobody got time for that. Shout for the shirt, shit, y'all don't want to hit the like button on this motherfucker. Shout out to Levi. Then, with him too, he bought the cards. Uh, yeah, B, I suppose that's true. He's like, man, I ain't fucking with you. We got bronchitis. Get a kid to try to check the milk or something. <laughs> um, yeah, I enjoyed those. The John Elway. Dan Marino was probably one of my favorite 30 for 30s. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, well, you don't you don't you don't play to be loved by your teammates. You play to to win championships. Patrick Ewing, my guy, my favorite NBA player of all time, was greatly respected. Guess how many championships he has. So Oh, thank you very much. Are you Mr. Rowe? Yeah. Uh, I received a note when I checked in my office. Yeah, all the way. That the Mr. Carson I know, right? It feels like there's not a commercial, Levi. They're killing me. Yeah, exactly. Zero. And you know, all the way. So we do it the hard way. Well. And I don't have to appear or produce. You ain't the only one. Hey, shit. Charlie Barkley don't got no rings. They didn't like his competitiveness. Oh, Fabs, who did you talk to that, 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 that you know that they didn't like his competitiveness? You realize that's fucking stupid, right? Uh, yeah, no, I don't think Ewing was soft at all. Yeah, crazy. Like... Damian Lee has no right coming for Luca at all. His name's not even like no one cares about Damian Lee. The only reason Damian Lee's being talked about is because he said some fuck shit to Luca. That motherfucker don't matter. And he knows he don't matter. Owner of a chain of motels called Saddleback Inns, and one time owner of the Portland Storm in the World Football League, a former USC football player. Pippen was just as good as MJ. Really? All right. So when MJ went to go play baseball, how many titles did the Bulls win? I'll wait. 
One. <laughs> Zero. I was just talking shit. I can't have my foot. Wait. <laughs> Pippen went to Portland. How many titles did they win? When Pippen went to Houston, how many titles did they win? Just get, do some research on that. Pull that up and then get back to me when you get a chance. I know he went to Houston. I thought he was Blazers. I think he did a year in Houston. I'm not 100% sure on the Houston. Uh, that's not what I, said. I thought he went to the I don't know about Houston. I know he was on the Blazers. Yeah, but that's what I'm saying. Like, you know, I'm not going to say that. Yeah, exactly. None. Uh, he won zero championships without Michael Jordan. So the idea that he was better or just as good as Michael Jordan is fucking ridiculous. Stop. <laughs> yeah, exactly. So Jesse was better than Michael Jordan. <laughs> But that was the coach. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> Bill Jackson did win a championship with the Knicks. <laughs> yeah, so for those who don't know, that's what you said. Find somebody Al, 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 Davis, <laughs> Al Davis sued the National Football League. He sued him. Yeah, he sued him. How much he make? He was tired of their shit. Uh, Pippen's not underrated for people that actually have watched basketball. Like, Pippen is properly rated. I know that little short neck who's on all space jail. I know he's underrated like a motherfucker. Muggsy Bowes? You don't even know his name. I know who, I know who team he played for. What team he played for? I know the team. Shut up. Wait a minute. All right, then. Hold on, shut up. I don't know. I'm dead serious. I do know. Dead, dead. Shit. I don't, I don't label. Okay, I knew. I, I, I was 75% sure he played with the Rockets, but I wasn't, I wasn't 100% sure. I can't think of the team name, but shit, because they changed the logo. He was very biased. He was NFL all the way. Charlotte Hornets. Else that matters. You wouldn't even stand up. Because they were the Charlotte Wildcats. No, they were the Charlotte Hornets. Yeah, then they became they, the Bobby Yeah, Then they were back to the Hornets. Yeah, they were the Wildcats again. <laughs> no, yes, he is. So, see. I knew they was. I knew, I knew the logo. I knew it was a bubble beat. I was like, I was thinking about uh, No, that's factually incorrect. Uh, if you want to argue, Dennis Rodman is a top three rebounder of all time. That's a safe conversation to have. If you want to argue if he's top two of all time, if you want to say Dennis Rodman is the best rebounder in modern basketball history, that's a conversation I have. To say Dennis Rodman is the best defender in the history of the NBA is fucking stupid. I say that with love. He was better on Detroit, though, than my own the Chicago Bulls. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Mm. This is why was better off got them Detroit Pistons. Mm. Well, you crazy. No, nah, I would say no, the, because I, Rodman just really like he was good at defense and good at defense and rebounded a lot, but crazy's not wrong. I think I would take Ben Wallace over Rodman as well. I think I would take Ben Wallace. Don't get me wrong, I know Ben. I know Ben. Wow, I like uh that. yeah, yeah. He averaged like nine or ten points a game throughout his career. Huge difference maker. I mean, he's like a specialty guy. You know what I mean? He's one of the tools you use in your toolbox. All right, it's a commercial, Levi. Which you want me to open? No, we ain't do nothing. No, we're about to crack no, Levi's packs if he if he's in here. If not, we have to wait. I said modern NBA. Babs, tell me, tell me, first of all, Will Chamberlain played when there was like 12 teams in the league, eight teams in the league, some shit like that. So I don't want to hear that shit. What don't three for mine? Like I get to tell, oh well, Will Chamberlain. Yeah, yeah, oh really? How many teams were in the league when Will Chamberlain was in the league? Stop. Dwight Howard? 
Dwight Howard was a beast with the magic. He was. Matt Taylor, he fell the fuck off. I mean, Dwight Howard's still a first ballot Hall of Famer. As is Chris Bosh. Yeah, exactly. Same with Bill Russell. Like, they played against fucking eight teams, 12 teams. Like, guys, come on. It's not a comparable. It's just, it's nothing against people from back in the day. It's just not a comparable. No, Bean, that's honest. If honest and cold are the same thing. All right, don't move. I know. That's what I'm saying. Maybe it's his Wi Fi. That's true. Oh, no, no. Well, because they weren't conditioned. They weren't conditioned like that. All right, cool. Small wrinkles of white showed up around his eyes. Hairlines like secondary highlights on the road map in Mexico. Dude, it will be ready. I signed. Look okay, we good. We just wait for Cam and Fish's Wi Fi connection. Look, I like Shaq, but. And she wants the fight night. That's a good dude with him. Hit the white button. What all has been going on in pro football over the years? A merger and all those kind of things. But I know one thing. These fish don't know who we are or where we came from. Yeah, crazy. I'm about right there with you. I'm about right there with you. 80s, mid to late 80s. I'm right there with you. I uh, did yo Sebastian LeBron James not in there LeBron James not better than T Mac or Kobe or Garnett like yo we're just gonna pretend LeBron doesn't exist I mean yeah but he's saying the top three players he's saying the top three players in high school of all time are Kobe Garnett and T Mac and it's like well wait I'm pretty sure LeBron LeBron's kind of good. LeBron, did we not forget about Fitz Carter? Mm-hmm. Fitz Carter was the shit too. But like to leave to leave LeBron, like, and you get asked crazy. He calls me a Laker hater all the time, but no, I can't say LeBron. To leave LeBron to say LeBron's not a top three. You there, there's no argument. LeBron is the greatest player to ever come out of high school. Like that's not even a debate. Yeah. That's not even a debate. I already know that he stand the bread. He stand up. He can say that name in my house. Although it is really <laughs> qu- close with him and Kwame Brown, I suppose. Yeah, since we're out here house. being, yo, like, <laughs> what the fuck? He get pushed out every time he says the bread. <laughs> at the there at the door. Yeah, I guess LeBron's okay. I mean, you know. <laughs> In the car, baby. I said it. Yeah, Sebastian, you, you, you kind of messed up on that one, man. Don't give me more, Sebastian. He's still a car, baby, though. The white James still a car, baby. I don't give a damn what the white James said. I just have to hello. He's still a car, baby. I said it. The car, baby, is. I feel gay. Wait, wait. What's we a different team? They try to get everybody on that team. Well, I thought we had baby bastards. Hey, man, I would run from bad management, too. That's all I'm saying. The latte wish was fucking your power. You want to leave. You lost me a bender. Uh, although he was decent with the Pacers. Jermaine O'Neal, though, he's up there. I mean, he's not top three. But, yo, Jonathan Bender was actually played for the Pacers, too, I believe. All right, so apparently LeBron James isn't. I, I I learned something new every stream. What I learned this stream is LeBron James isn't a top three high school player of a uh, player to come out of high school all time. So I guess that puts him four, which is very odd because 
he's the second best NBA player I've ever seen play in my lifetime. And so. What the fuck? Yeah, I'd fuck that pussy. What's that? Yo, you know she loves Coke. You can just tell. <laughs> or Pepsi. <laughs> nah, bro. She loves Coke. She don't even fuck with Pepsi. She wants that. She wants that boot and toot it type shit. Look at her. She's the same way, too. <laughs> Look at her. Look at her. She bite the hell out of the devil. <laughs> I think he's an idiot. Who is Ernie's so goat? Who is Ernie's goat? Uh, Michael Jordan, LeBron James, and Kareem Abdul-Jabbar are my top three in that order. Well, obviously, he's the commissioner of the National Football League. I think without God, his no. involvement in the conspiracy, without his involvement, this has been Deshaun Watson has zero interest in the Broncos. None. Why would he go to the Broncos? For what? To go compete? No. No. Well, yeah, it's an Indiana nigga. We could use you. Mm-hmm. Don't be on that bullshit like Philip Rivers. We get rid of your ass, too. Wayne Howard or Don, if they couldn't remember the name of the team. I got a little baby shit. Do me a favor, y'all. Hit that like button. Hit the subscribe, hit the super chat. It's definitely Kareem over Magic for me. Crazy. It's definitely Kareem over Magic. We stay away from Levi to make his little. Skinny, black, wherever he is. I don't know what the hell Levi is. I don't know. That nigga idiot. Shit, he probably is. If he don't wait, Levi, we wait for your idiot ass. Ain't nobody got top Indians. Ain't nobody got top Indians. Big ass up in here so we can open up your packs. I got yo crazy. I'm this this thirty for thirty didn't go the direction I thought it would. I thought it would really dig deep into. Uh, I, I don't have one. Isaac has like 15 favorite teams. I only have one favorite team. I got two. My team. Yo, mama's favorite team. <laughs> Yo, you like the Colts. You like the Browns. You like the Packers. I say I really don't like the Browns. The only reason why I like the Browns is the way it goes at that whole You like whoever is winning that week. Let's be real. I don't like the, I, I really don't like them. <laughs> I don't care for them. They are. Right, I don't care for them. Don't fuck with Cowboys at all. That big Cowboys fan. Do not, really don't fuck with the goddamn Patriots. Ah, oh, because that's my homie. Uh, yo, we call it the dozens. We just like, yo, we clown on each other from time to time. Really don't fuck with the goddamn Patriots. Mm. Hey. Grant Hill. Grant Hill. What? Grant Hill. I was answering this question. I would say Grant Hill. I know that's not going to be a, the popular opinion, but I'm going Grant Hill. Great, I wouldn't say great. Or great, or was would be good. You know, but say he just you know what I'm saying. He just came up. He was the shit. Bro. He was playing for Iowa State though. At college. Um. Also, NFL rumors for you guys. Chris Godwin is the Buccaneers have serious interest, and in Chris Godwin expected to offer him a massive deal, and. Expect Carson Wentz to be traded by the trade deadline. Yeah, Grant Hill had everything. And then even after even after his injury, like his brutal injury, and after like he made a decent recovery when he went to Suns, and I still think he had a decent career, but he could have been Oh man, what could have been with Grant Hill? I don't speak for other people. It's hard enough to speak for yourself. So I can't say why Rizal can't focus on the team at that moment. Uh, he can go anywhere. The Washington team. Well, I don't think the Eagles make a deal in division. I mean, the Broncos, the Panthers. I resolved to dominate the offensive by home. 
Uh, more so Brandon Roy. I loved him on the Blazers. I was really excited for him. Jay Will could have been dope if not for the motorcycle accident. Well, I feel like Brandon Roy could have really been something special. Um, I thought they hired one, but I'm not exactly sure. Levi, you missed the fucking, you missed two commercials. You can't squirt, like, you can't squirt the fucking computer. All right, Levi, we'll pull it back now. Yeah, like 20 minutes ago. Put the strap up. All right, here we go. Commercial, Levi. Let's rip. Let's rip, bro. What you want? What you want? You want NBA contenders? You want NFL contenders? You want SBX, Ovation, Select? You go wait for this commercial. It's not my fault you took a nappy nap. Well, wake your ass up. Mm-hmm. Let's go, Levias. Choppy, choppy. Wake up, nigga. Boom. <laughs> NBA. All right. Hand me the NBA. I'm going to call here. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I know, right? Boom. <laughs> All right, let's see what we got here. Are you over here dropping Shay? Shay Gildas Alexander from Kentucky. John Wall from Kentucky. Dumbass mascot card. Hey, I want that. <laughs> Another dumbass mascot card. Hey, I want that too. <laughs> Damn, this is a Kentucky pack. Anthony Davis. Hey. Yo, it's all Kentucky. And De'Aaron Fox. Literally, all four of your cards that weren't must uh, that were fucking mascots were Kentucky. John Wall, uh, Shy Gillis Alexander, De'Aaron Fox, and Anthony Davis. Yeah, that, that All right, let's go pack two. Let's go pack two. Use some tiger teeth. Got to use some tiger teeth. It only takes about a minute. Which team is this? Victor Oladipo. Indiana cards. <laughs> Indiana. Buddy Heald. Oklahoma. Isaac Okoru. And Auburn from the 2020 draft class. Oh, wow. Christian Leighton or Duke. Oh, I guess it's a Duke bag. RJ Barrett, my guy from Duke. And Drew Holiday from UCLA. Uh, it's close, crazy. It, that's a that's actually a really good question. I'd probably lean. I went ahead and go Kentucky. I mean, John Wall can't stay. I, I'd probably I lean Duke, but I had to go with Kentucky. it's close. The last time so many people got together in Los Angeles for the Raiders, it had some. Oh, there we go, John ja Morant. That's what you were looking for right there. Ja Moran. Wow, Gail Goodrich. That's some old school shit. Dual Jimmy Butlers, one bread foil, one regular. And Pascal Siakam. Woo! Yo, I cannot wait for that NBA fucking mosaic to get you. Eight cards a pack, ten packs per box. Woo! That shit's gonna be nuts. You pull a Zion on that, it's a 
two to four hundred dollar card easy. That's all the bench. So now. All the NBA. Legal appeals oh. meant the Raiders now we got a football on this model. Justice League attorneys had anticipated It depends on what football you want, sir. Follow sure got to the words. Turning their back on the loyalty. The sports, the we got to select. Ovation. In favor of the tenders. And newer stadiums. And other I don't know what this one is. If I don't mind. You can call that. The allegations. <laughs> All right, Levi. If you're in here, we'll finish off Panini Contenders. NFL. We get that Pack right on top. I think that's the last pack. Let me see. Let me see. How many bucks? In fact, it may shit. No, I don't have a damn time. All right, throw that shit away. But I want to make sure. All right, here we go. Levi, I wanted to clean out uh, contenders first. That way, uh, when I change setup, I can let Isaac start running the Lakers stream, and then. After I get changed and everything, I can take over. Jalen Ramsey, your boy Thomas, Jeremiah, ba Bartholomew Brady the third. Drew, I got one leg lock. Tredavious, I got tore up in the AFC Championship game white. Rain, Dakota Prescott. I guess I'll always refer to it as Jason Witten for the Raiders. Teddy Bridgewater and winning ticket, Christian McCaffrey. All right, I'm going to go ahead and get off of here. For instance, he hired the first minority head coach to win a Super Bowl. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and get off here. We'll set up for the Lakers game. I will let uh, Isaac run it. Yo, that John Morant. Sit on that John Morant for a couple years. Um, I'm gonna go change. I'm gonna set up the. Yeah, no, crazy. You're not wrong. It's a, for me. It's extremely close, right? Yes, I'm It's it's extremely close. It's extremely close. All right, give me a pack of ovation for Levi. Hell no. Just pick one. That's all right, motherfucker. I don't care. Just give me one. They're all his anyway. They're all mine. Mine, 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 mine. All right, Levi. Yeah. You said I got two of these, two more of these. I just let you roll. I don't do that, man. I don't smoke, man. I don't smoke. Let's smoke Black Miles. Ken McNown. That's what I'm about to go do in a minute. Antonio Friedman. Steve Berline. Steve Smith. Oh, that's dope. Look at that Fred Taylor for the Jags. Hey, Taylor. Dude, that is cold. Fred Taylor. And star performance, Brad Johnson from the Washington team. Bless our. He's talking about Black Miles, not Black people. <laughs> no, I said Black Miles. I mean, don't get me wrong. I never told about this. Actually, I can buy it. What's the first thing I actually smoked? The first thing I smoked. Me too. Not like you. Yeah, I went to cigarettes. They went back to black bottles. I've uh, never smoked a cigarette in my life. Now I'm smoking cigars. Yeah, yo, well, Isaac wasn't before born before. Uh, Isaac wasn't even born before Super Bowl Fifty One. So, a lot of stuff is before his time. I came after. Yeah, he came after Super Bowl Fifty One. So he's like almost four. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna go change. I'm gonna go change. All right, guys, we're going to go ahead and end the stream. I'm going to set up the new stream. 
No, and uh, we will see you guys for the Lakers. We'll see you guys for the Lakers. Uh, they're about to demolish the Nuggets. Back has room up, yo, Puff Gang. Why you gotta be racist against fat people, bro? It's fucked up.